Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of February 8th through February 14th, but keep in mind the timing is still fluid. This could happen the week after. It could happen at any time, okay? But this is the message that I am pulling in for you. Uh, keep in mind that not every reading is for you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. What do we have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What do we have for Libra? What do we have for Libra? That's quite a few. I'm going to take them. One, two, three, four, five, six, six. On the path to balance and harmony. You're on the right path, okay? This is a time of transition for you. Flute. Disappointment in a friend or a lover. Pale. Time to get out of a situation. Dog. Protection from a powerful friend. You have some sort of protection here. Cracked cup. Dissatisfaction with life. Harp. Great happiness. August. August is very prominent. Now, great happiness, and then August was behind it. By August, and I know August seems like it's a long ways away, you will be extremely happy. Right now, you're obviously dissatisfied with life. You do have protection from a friend. You have to get out of a situation to get to this happiness. Whoever you're dealing with that you're disappointed with, you have to get out of it. I mean, it's all right there. You're disappointed in somebody. You need to get out of the situation. There is some sort of protection. Right now, you're dissatisfied. Great happiness is coming by August, but it's going to take you a minute because you have to get out of this situation. And some of you may say, I'm already out of it. Well, if your energy isn't out of it, then you're not out of it. So... By August, you're going to be extremely happy. And August, it's time flies. We all know it. So I do see that it's time for you to get out of something. It may take uh, a lot of strength. It may take a lot of courage. Um, it's not going to be easy. It's never easy to get out of a situation. It isn't. It isn't. If things were easy, we wouldn't be strong. So, yeah. What do we have for Libra? I do feel like you are in the process of getting out of a situation. Some of you have already removed yourself from the situation, but your energy is still there. Your thoughts. King of Raphael. Warm, generous, honorable, and refined. Yes, it is safe to trust. The ability to accomplish many things at once. Follow your creative passions. This is the King of Wands. So it is safe for you to trust. The ability to accomplish many things at once. Follow your creative passions. It might be the King of Cups, actually. This is the King of Cups, not the King of Wands. I'm sorry. Because Raphael, yeah, it's about, yeah, it's about love. So yeah, this is the, I don't know why I said King of Wands. This is the King of Cups. So anyhow, so this is about love. It's about uh, using your intuition, getting creative, following your heart, listening to your heart, listening to your gut. Self-love. It's about self-love. Perhaps you have an opportunity for love with the King of Cups. Somebody, somebody may, you know, be opening their heart to you or you need to open your heart to them but there's lack of trust it says it is safe for you. maybe this is your friend you may have a friend that is trying to protect you okay but you but it feels like you're, you're not trusting you have to trust now the king of wands is about creativity because I mentioned the king of wands but it's also about taking action it's confidence 
willpower, determination. So you need to find all those attributes and have no fear. The King of Wands is about no fear. So you, you have to open your heart and have no fear. Somebody loves you by the looks of things. Somebody really, really loves you or they have feelings for you and you may be ignoring it because of your distrust. What do we have for Libra? What do we have for Libra? I can't shuffle them like that. These decks are too stiff. Yeah, Magician reversed. Magician reversed is not manifesting, not manifesting. Um, answer is no, don't trust. Yeah, you don't trust, you don't trust. There's been some manipulation here, lies, self-deception maybe. Um, unwilling, unwilling to shed the old, to bring in the new. Somebody needs to take action right now. They need to take action. They need to be willing. They need to... Uh, open their heart. It feels like somebody's trying to manifest something that they are not supposed to manifest. You know, you can't you can't force somebody to love you. You know, so that's interesting. Um magician reverse, that is a no. It's a no answer to something. Hmm. Receiving generosity in the past. Now, this is have and have not, give and take. Somebody's only been getting crumbs while somebody else has been getting everything. So there's been, I feel like there's been a lack because this is reversed of equality. There's been a lack of reciprocation. I feel like, I feel like you haven't been getting what you deserve. I feel like you've been putting in a lot of effort and you've been manipulated, maybe lied to. I mean, this is lies. It's manipulation. It's a trickster. Somebody that has some tricks up their sleeve. Somebody that is a pathological liar that doesn't tell the truth. Maybe that's why you don't trust. But this is also trying to manifest or, you know, the magician reverse is somebody who, you know, does, it's almost like black magic. You know, they, they try to get something that, uh, you know, they, they, they try to enforce their will on another person, you know, manipulatively. And they, they, they don't get what, they, they, there's no help from above. So they, they don't get any, they don't get anywhere with that. Okay. You, you don't, if it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be. So somebody is, is, has been trying to get something that isn't meant to be. That's exactly what we have here. Anyhow, um, Magician Reverse, that is no, 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 no. Um, regrets, regrets, worry, anxiety. Oh my God, why is this happening? You're going to, and this is in the future. So you may be experiencing some sort of anxiety. Could be somebody that you're dealing with as well. You may be dealing with somebody who has lost their power because this is a loss of power over you. And they may be having regrets. You need to go after what you deserve. Maybe that's what you've done. Maybe you're going after what you deserve. Maybe you're opening your heart. Maybe you're falling in love with somebody else. I don't know. But you, I think you have a master manipulator here who may be having some regrets. This could also be your energy. Somebody here is experiencing some sort of turmoil. They are overwhelmed. They're in their thoughts. They're in their mind. And they are negative. These are negative thoughts. You know, and they are feeling guilty. I feel like we have somebody here that is guilty. They're guilty, or they should be, you know, or they should be feeling guilty. Um, anyhow, the Nine of Swords is overwhelmed. Why is this happening? This is too much. Repeating negative patterns. Somebody is repeating negative patterns, and now there's some sort of consequences. Uh, I feel like somebody is, you know, I'm not sure what is going on, but you could be dealing with somebody who has done something. You know, the Magician Reverse is a trickster, somebody that really doesn't have any morals. So I feel like we, somebody, I don't know, whenever I see this card in this deck, I think of jail. So I'm not sure if somebody is going to end up or rehab or hospital or something um, for poor, poor behavior. Um, either way, this is, didn't we have protection? There is some sort of protection here. You are being protected. You know, rejection is God's protection. And maybe you don't understand that. But there is some sort of protection here. I do feel like we have somebody here that is 
overwhelmed and in some sort of stressful situation that they need to get out of. Okay, they need to get out of it. But there's a lack of action, you know, and trying to, you know, manifest something that isn't meant to be, which is interesting. Um, three of Cups. So it could be a third party situation here. This is not a celebration. It is not a reunion. It's not happy. Okay, this is not, this is not happiness. It's, it's it feels like you've been trying to to give somebody something or trying to get something out of somebody who has nothing to offer emotionally and i feel like this is draining i feel like it's emotionally draining there could be some drinking problems here i'm not sure somebody may have some drinking problems somebody's lying they are definitely lying they're lying about what they're giving you or what they're going to give you. It's not true. And I feel like you really need to um, part ways. This is parting ways from friends or family. You know, you deserve more than crumbs. You deserve more than they're giving you. But you may not see it because of lack of awareness with the magician reversed. You know, and really stressing over perhaps something that you want that isn't meant to be. So I feel like you're really stressed out this week. Um, this, this is not happiness, unfortunately, unfortunately with the three of cups reversed, that's parting ways, um, from a master manipulator or somebody that lies all the time. So, uh, this is somebody that is very, very good at manipulating, very skilled, very, very skilled at, you know, pretending that they can give you what you want, but they don't have, you know, the means to give you what they want, what you want. Um, Empress. Now the Empress is a, is you is your energy. This is a this is a creating a new life. This is a mother. This is a nurturer. This is a caregiver. Somebody that does everything with love. That is very valuable. And somebody is definitely having regrets. Now this is knowing your value. So you may know your value, and maybe you need to know your value this week. This is about, this is a time of fertility, it's a time of incubation, it's a time of love and abundance and being loved and cared for. I know that there is somebody here that loves you, I'm positive. It could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, it doesn't have to be, it could be anybody. But I feel like we have somebody here that, and maybe it could be you, we have somebody here that has some extreme regrets over not taking action when they should have. Um... Now, the Empress creates a new life. It is painful, though. It is painful. So, I feel like, yeah, but in the future, you're going to be uh, creating a new life where there's a lot of love and abundance. But you have to leave that pain behind you. You have to leave the manipulation behind you. You have to leave the lies behind you. You need to open your heart. There is somebody here that sees your value, that sees your value, that sees your beauty, that sees your worth. Okay, and wants to take care of you. So I feel like we have somebody here that really wants to take care of you. But you're distrustful. And you're distrustful because of a previous uh, deception, you know, a previous situation where you were manipulated and lied to and, and hurt. Um, I do see um, a lack of emotional growth with that Three of Cups reversed. Um, a third party situation and I don't I don't see there being any reunion I don't see there being a reunion and and thinking you know what if I would have done this what if I would have done that you know that kind of thing it's not your fault I think whoever you're dealing with is unstable okay I think that they're unstable they may have some mental health issues okay they may have some mental health issues and there's there's nothing you can do about that there isn't I, I feel like uh, this week you have the opportunity to go down a path and create that new life that leads to great happiness. But it definitely will require you to uh, take action. And you haven't been really taking action because a magician, somebody has taken the power and you've allowed them to take the power away from you. I feel like you are definitely protected. They may have something to do with a mother here. Um, and this, and this doesn't have to, this could be a grandmother, something like that. There's protection here and it could be, even be a friend. There's, or it could be an angel because I wanted to say angels at one point. Oh, it was up here when I wanted to say it because I happened to notice this angel very prominently. I do feel like there is some sort of protection here. Somebody is trying to protect you from harm and from somebody that 
doesn't see your value and they're bringing and they feel like they've brought you somebody to protect you on this earthly plane but you are so caught up in this manipulation you know or trying to manifest something that isn't meant to be so anyhow i think this is the birth of a new life for you i feel like there's some tender loving care coming your way i think that there is um parting ways with with friends or family or some or a third party situation where there's been obviously a lot of deception and lies i think that it's time for you to go after what you deserve i can see that you're disappointed it's time to get out of this situation you're being protected you've been dissatisfied with life great happiness comes as soon as you release the pain whatever this pain is and like i said it's, you're still in the energy by August, you will be at a point of, of uh, reaping some sort of reward from the pain that you have endured. Put it that way. Um, mm -hmm. We definitely have somebody here that is regretting how they treated uh, another person as what the, this empress, which is your energy. So we, there is somebody that regrets it. They do regret it, but they're not going to change. Okay, this person is pathological. You, you, you can't, or some, or they, or they have mental health issues. You can't, you can't, you don't, you can't change that. So you know, it's time for you to uh, allow yourself to be cared for. Allow yourself to be loved. So this is a week where you. Um, I don't know. It looks like you need to part ways for good. You need to say no. You may need to say no to somebody. You may need, because that is no, 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 no. You may need to say no. And I think it's going to be hard. It's going to be stressful to say no. But if you know your value, you will. Good luck.